Hello, welcome back Transformer TCG fans. Thanks for following, thanks for being here. Um, yeah, I did just release a little video about three minutes long earlier today. And we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. In the meantime, let's go through this as fast as we can go and let's transform and get into it. Soundwave. Yeah, we already have Soundwave. Yeah, we already have these characters. But I wanted to do something different that is looks good might be more fun to play with i don't know i like the functionality i like how these characters are going to work um i haven't played with the sound Bla sound wave or blaster decks in a while the starter i do have them uh you know when the game was coming out i was selling stuff and selling stuff and using my money and buying boxes and buying all the starter sets um, so I just about have everything, just about. Um, yeah, there's a few su super rares that I don't have, and you just can't even find Wave Five anymore. It's just gone. Uh, they it was the lowest run, but a sound wave. Um, I've I've played around with their stats a little bit and their star counts. He is communications. He's a leader and a specialist. He's 10 star character with 14 health. In alt mode, he's zero attack and one defense. Ouch, yeah. Well, he in alt mode, he does have stealth, except if you play these as the actual set, this stealth isn't gonna matter, especially for his first turn. If you're opponent goes first stealth isn't going to matter he's going to be the only one on the on the on the table because the other three are going to be underneath him let's keep just keep going when you flip to this mode scrap two cards off the top of your deck if one is an action you may put it in your hand this is going to be pertinent in a minute this can start with a mac oh Never mind. I see how I worded this now. This can start with a max of two Battle Master Mini Cassettes under it, and it shows the two different traits. Well, I didn't say Battle Master and Mini Cassettes, or Battle Master or Mini Cassettes. I had that originally, and I took it off. Because I thought, okay, no. The only characters I want under this sound wave are the ones that I've created. Now, they can start in bot mode by themselves, if you so want to, but two of them can go under Soundwave. So you will have a Soundwave in one of the three characters. Two can, can go in him, but not all three at the same time. Uh, so you'll need to choose a Frenzy, Ravage, or Laser Beak separately. Um, now, my... Rat Bat Fuel Expert that I created. He's an eight star character. Uh, I've got him in this in this group too because I've got all my cassette. Uh, I just labeled it cassettes. I've got uh, I threw my Rat Bat in here. I've got the three new ones and I got this Soundwave. So that's why Rat Bat is in front of me and, and he works great with my Energon cards, which is the utility that gives everybody a plus. Uh, one to attack, plus one to defense, and plus one health. Um, and it's not a star card because it can be so easily vaporized or crush with crushing size if anybody even uses that card anymore. Uh, there's that. So let, let, let's focus here on, on, on Soundwave and these three new ones. Um, so you can have a max of two Battle Master mini cassettes under it. Uh, when we flip him over to bot mode, He's still a leader and specialist. His attack is five, his defense is two. He has Pierce Bolt, Pierce Bolt, Pierce One and Bold One. This gives, so there is a when you flip on here, but when he's in bot mode, this gives each Battle Master mini cassette, I didn't say and or, or on your team, Bold One and Pierce One until end of turn. When you flip to this mode and your first action is played for turn, 
you may deploy a Battlemaster mini cassette from under this in bot mode. Um, the, the cassette, come. Uh, he always ejects them. The action, play in an act, whatever your action is, it doesn't matter what the action, it could be a tech research. That allows him to go boop and out comes a character, okay? But the characters in the show didn't come out and go cathud and, and, and fall down as a cassette did later turn into its bot mode. This is the card game. I'm trying to mimic the show a little bit. So when you flip him to bot mode, play an action, it's akin to hitting his button. Then you can deploy a character from one of the two characters from underneath in bot mode. They start in bot mode because they're battle masters. Um, they're, like I said, battle master mini cassette. Um, so now let's look at the three characters. And I only did three. I'm not going to do any more. Uh, and, and Frenzy is based on his original color. Not red, but blue. I didn't understand this until not that long ago. Uh, because I didn't have the original toys back in the 80s. I didn't. Oh, well, I didn't have Soundwave and the cassettes. I really wanted them. Uh, they were a little more than some of the other characters. He was like the price range of like the leaders, like Optimus or Megatron. And my parents were there, you know, we weren't rich. I thought we were because of the, some of the nice stuff we had, but they were real tight with money. Uh, and I didn't realize how tight money was even back then. I had no idea, but we were very fortunate. And that's all I got to say about that. Um, real fortunate and grateful for what little I had and all the hand-me-downs I got. So, Frenzy. All, they're all five-star characters. Frenzy is a battle master, mini cassette, and a ranged character. Um, I love this picture. I meant to do the two, other two first because they're pictures of the toys that came off the same box Soundwave came in because they came with Soundwave, but Frenzy didn't. Um, I found this online. Looks great on the card. Two to attack, eight health, one defense. Stealth. He's the only one that has an ability like this. Stealth. They all have tap abilities. Frenzy is a tap ability. Scrap two enemy upgrades on a character. So if you want to give up him attacking, you can scrap uh, two enemies, uh, two upgrades, two enemy upgrades on a character. So it has to be one character with at least two upgrades and tap Frenzy. They come off. Um, it's, you know, like his dri pile driver sort of simulation in the game. Laser beak. Uh, attack a three, health of eight. They all have health of eight. Defense of zero. His tap ability. Give pierce two to another Decepticon on your team for turn. Um, so he's tapping laser beak is going to give someone pierce. Has to be a Decepticon, of course. If you're playing these all together, you're going to give one of the one of the others a pierce too. When this defends against a car or truck, it gets plus two for battle. So the zero defense is now two if it's playing against uh, anybody. Uh, anybody, and it doesn't have to be an Autobot, but a, a just a car or truck. Uh, Ravage in his bot mode, he's got three attack, eight health, one to defense. Notice he doesn't have stealth like I gave Frenzy. Uh, but his tap ability, give bold two to another Decepticon on your team for a turn. So these guys only like their Decepticons. They don't want to mix, um, which is in line with their personality. When this attacks a car or truck or motorcycle, this gets plus one to attack. So if he's any of those three traits, his uh, uh, base attack is now four. Um, well, yeah. They're all battle masters, didn't you notice? So Ravage, when we're on Ravage, he gets KO'd. He turns into microcapacitor ROM. And he turns into an upgrade. He turns into a utility that gives plus one to attack, plus one to defense, pierce one, and tough one. It's He's a decent, nice, basic upgrade. While this is upgraded on a character, it has stealth when untapped. 
Uh, so there's that. Uh, I didn't have the arrow. I just added the arrow and capitalized the I in it. For you grammar freaks out there. Um, and I can be one. So there, there's that. Um, so he's going to give characters stealth in, when they're untapped. Uh, when he's as a utility. I like that. It fits Ravage. You even think of Beast Wars when he had his arms in his ship and he starts turning invisible and turning on his stealth. He gives everything else stealth. It, 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 or the the illusion uh, that was re that was really cool um so there's that well that was ravage laser beak turns into the weaponized ram he's the weapon ravage is the utility laser beak turns into a weapon with bold two pierce one and, and plus two to attack um Battlemaster Frenzy. Frenzy turns into... Okay. I, I found this picture online because I originally had the p images of the G1 toy and it just looked terrible on here. Uh, it did not look like the... Now, I don't have that edition of Blaster. I found I got a few cards online from TCG Player or somewhere um, for pretty cheap where it has the original 80s artwork on the cards, which was kind of cool. But I found this online. There was more to this picture than this, but I really wanted to focus on just Frenzy's cassette. Uh, and if you look at the 80, his 80s toy, it has the text micro number E4289 on there. So that's what his upgrade name is. He turns into the armor with plus two to defense and gives any character equipped tough two. So now, originally I was only, they all had st six stars. They were not five stars, which gave them six, six, and six, which now that I think about it, it's kind of funny. So I was changing it to where you could put them all in together in one deck. Originally their health was over 40. You could only have three of them in play, Soundwave and two cassettes. So that's why Soundwave shows on there, he can have a max of two of two of them under him. I'm not changing that. I'm going to leave that out there. So if you want to have Frenzy out and put the other two under, that would be interesting. Because Frenzy has stealth, Soundwave and Alt Mode has stealth. Uh, if your opponent goes first, they can choose whichever one they want to go into. Uh, unless you want to have one of the others uh, that doesn't have stealth, out they would have and they go first they'd have to go into your battle master first so you would start off kind of like too tall but you've got two more characters inside Soundwave that you can deploy and get out um and Soundwave is going to be dancing he's going to be flipping in order to be able if you don't have some draw power to where you know flipping him to alt mode scrap two cards oh this one's in action i'm putting it in my hand when you flip him back to bot mode for turn, play an action, deploy a character. I like it. Um, are they powerful? Eh, they're, they, their stats seem kind of average in total. Uh, now their, their total health is 38, which is still comparable with, say, a little more than the average. It's, it's, it's very close to uh, comparable with a combiner. Uh, from wave two. So they have some healthy health, healthy health, and I brought down their total. It was like a, uh, over 40, but then when it was, it was actually a total of 44, but with their star count, you couldn't play them all in, 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 at the same time. So now with five stars, bringing down their health, you can get them all in play, all together. If you want to have them as a team all, uh, like this, um, get you get get those inner groove uh, battle cards uh, warmed up and primed to play with these guys. Get 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 those quartermasters to be able to get these back on Soundwave. Uh, it seems like it would be very fun. Um, I mean, the be best way for Soundwave to attack is a bot mode. Uh, but I uh, I don't know. You know 
Battle-wise, they may not do very well. Technically, it looks like in practice, this would be fun. Uh, uh, no, I'm trying not to print too much, or I would really have liked to have done this with actual cards or some physical media instead of seeing my mug again. But what do you think? I like this. I like this a lot. Um, I like it better because I went 10 minutes less than my last video that I tried doing this with. Um, but yeah, Soundwave, three cassettes. What say you? What you think? I, I think this will work. And if you didn't get a, the Blaster Soundwave de uh, starter deck, this is a way to get a, 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 new, a new Soundwave and three new uh, cassettes characters for a different kind of play to see how it goes. Um, and I've learned the hard, well, I won't say the hard way. I've had to learn everything the hard way. Um, is that it all comes down to your deck uh, for the most part. So, you know, if you know, you really, if when Laserbeak gets KO'd and you've got a fusion bore on Soundwave, do you really want to give up that fusion bore uh, for Laserbeak's weaponized RAM? You know, uh, it's not as strong. And do I have any perks when they're all, all three on a character? No, not really. Um, but I really didn't want to go five stars with these guys because most of our battle, uh, battle masters normally start at about six stars, officially, if you look at a lot of the official ones. So I've gone way too long. I hope that I got real passionate this morning about stopping stuff here. I'm still considering it. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens. But, you know, if you don't see me here anymore, look for me, Nifty88, Nifty88 on Rumble, if you don't see me here anymore. Uh, if anything, I might keep Transformers here and test the waters on Rumble, which I really don't care for being monetized or, or money. I don't, this isn't monetized. Um, and maybe have some, uh, do a little more, a little more open on my political beliefs um, than I can, I can do here, which I've been wanting so hard to say something, uh, even if I'm wrong uh, or don't have all my information, because I don't have a hell of a lot of time for research. I mean, I hear, I listen to politics all day, just about. Uh, sometimes it's very informative, sometimes it drags me down a little bit. But I've just really have a need to get my voice heard. I think that's what we all need to be doing. If we love this country, we need to exercise our rights. When we don't and when we're silent, we will get run over. And that's what's happening. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time, either here or on the flip side. And as always, Autobots flip out and let's roll for it. Hopefully for the not the last time. And thanks for watching.